Hey guys, it's Erica. New boy group alert. They are viewing left and right. Like these new boy, they don't stop coming. Um, but yes, we have Unite. It's a new boy group under brand new music. Uh, and we have a nine members. That's a nice odd number. Uh, we have Unho. We have who? How old is he? Oh, I guess. Well, a K-pop profile says a leader first, right? Um, so O one, and then he is the oldest number. Uh, unsung. Uh, we have Steve. I don't think I've ever met a Steve in K-pop, but here we go. Um, we have Hyunsung. We have Hyunsuk. We have Uno. Uno. Um, we have Day. Day E. Day E. Day E. Day E. Um, we have Kyungmoon. We have Seon, we ha and that's it. How? Yeah, okay, so not the biggest difference between the oldest and the youngest, 01 and 04, um, but but they are they are young. They are young. Are they children? I don't even know anymore. I don't know. All, I'm, all this important to me is I'm an adult. It, just, you know, like when you get to like the age sort of range, um, and so, like my brain just like turns off figuring out like how old people are, or if it's 2022, and you're an O2, you are 18. There, we'll go off that math. Um, wait, is that wrong? Is that O4, you're 18? And to, people born in 2004 are adults. Is that what you're telling me? The math calculator, I'm an old person, I can't do math. So 2022 <laughs> minus 2004 is 18 years. That, I. I'm just old, and you know, we're gonna just stop that. This is called Everybody, Everybody featuring DJ Juice, brand new music. You know, would it let go? I think this is a cute concept. Oh. Oh, DJ chilling in the back, guy. Right. Old school? No? But this sound is fun. Okay, they we are a little old school. Hold up. I speak too soon all the time. Ooh. Okay, get into it. Bring the swag. I like this a lot. It actually does have old school sound. I never know what I'm talking about. Sounds very interesting. We kind of expected from brand new. Oh, uh, the fish eye. Okay. This is funky. I'm liking this. It has the 90 vibes. Maybe? Maybe I'm just confused every second of my life. I like the rappers. They're dope. I like his style. Kinda gives me old school vibes. Yo, the pre-chorus girl! And visually, I'm loving the color palette. This is such a fun chorus. They have a lot of swag, even when they're kind of, it's interesting, they have like, some sections of music where they're kind of doing little freestyle dance moments. Oh! Oh, we are kicking it old school. Give it to me. I think choreography even goes back to- I mean, it's giving us bits and pieces. I like the thing with the fence, that's cool. But at least you know the core if he goes through the vibes. 
You get the fish islands. Were they rejecting? That was later. That was like 2010. Early 2010. That was super fun. That was really dope. I really liked it. I love the overall color palette. The aesthetics were really, really cool. I feel like visually, we don't get a lot of stuff that looks like this. So that was very, very dope. The sound was also really dope too as well. Because at first, it, I think it has like enough of like a contemporary sound to where without that sort of dance break section there where the DJ having fun. Um, without that, it sounds like a very modern song. But again, it has those elements of just like that old school sort of feel, which is really dope. And I liked for that at least what we saw what they did show for the dance break section it looked like they were doing some choreography from back in the day um and i think it's um yeah kind of like new jack swing era type choreography um which is really dope which i don't think we've with um comebacks and contemplate this sound wise haven't really done a whole lot of that um here and there they have but like for example um take like nct you was it use 90 love NCT's 90s love that was that sort of had that type of sound and but it didn't really go for that type of choreography it went a little bit in the beginning but it's kind of I like seeing it here I, again we didn't see the uh, we have bits and pieces of the choreography but again not a good look so dance part is gonna give us all the vibes we need to see um but it, but it looked like it was after the dance break section, which makes me very intrigued to check out if that's what they do um, choreography wise that I think that'd be really really cool to see them um, Do that and even like the settings visually they don't go like fully like old school and stuff. So it's a very interesting um, Comeback and in concept I really or er, comeback debut and concept um, which has me intrigued uh, But nothing I, like a brand new kind of just different stuff. You know what I mean? So it's not completely unexpected to get an unexpected comeback or debut. What am I talking about? I have no idea. My brain is gone. Has been gone for the last 24 years of my life. Um, but and I'm 24 years old. Um, but but yeah, that was very very cool to see. That I definitely want a better look at the choreography, girl. We gonna get a better look at that choreography. Uh, but yeah, and I feel like Brand New has always had a lot of focus on the individuality of like the members. Like I felt like every member kind of stood out and definitely did their own thing. Even the voices, the tones of the voices, everything like that. I feel like everybody kind of just like stood out, which is so interesting to get for like debut. Um, Cause I feel like with some debuts, with some comebacks, members shine a little bit more than others. Like it can be like, oh, this was this member's comeback. This was this member's comeback. You know what I mean? Just some certain members can have just very like iconic, moments parts of a choreography parts of a music video that just stick in your brain in your head but i feel like everybody had a really good balance of everything and it was a fun comeback or i, I can't say comeback fun debut fun concept i really like the sound it was very very fun um i can't wait to get a better look at that choreography so yes go to put your thoughts and comments down below what you thought about unite everybody featuring dj juice and he killed it that was really dope i like seeing him in the video and just seeing him chill and vibing in the back for a lot of it that was really dope to include him your thoughts comments down below if you like this video give this video a thumbs up if you liked me if you want to see more of my videos go and hit that subscribe button if you want to see my videos the second they come out hit that notification button if you want to follow me on social media twitter and instagram such as tiktok or in the description down below or at the end screen share this video to your friends thank you guys so, so much for watching love you and i'll talk to you guys later bye oh, when you call me, I'm Shame.